shot and killed by robbers and you never cared. How happy was I when my one and only car was stolen from me because of you. And now you walk into my home, stand before me and tell me about happiness. No, no, please don't punish me. I was just a little girl then, an overexcited little girl then. I never meant to hurt you. No, please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. I'm sorry for you. Hey, what happened to your guy? I mean, your boyfriend. Whatever happened to him? Where is he? No, there's no man in my life. I now realize how much I miss you. I've made mistakes in my past. I regret them. I don't. Honestly, if you give me another chance. I'm engaged to be married to Lisa. I'm sorry. Um, maybe you should um, ask Lara. She walked in here with a, a gift of socks and um, she's asking me to take her back. Is it true? Um, this is to say, I... You came to my office and I told you about my upcoming wedding with Abel. You told me you were happy for me. Only for you to go behind me and try to steal my life. See, um, Lisa, it's not what you think. You see, I'll, but I, I... But what? But what, you stupid hypocrite? But what? Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Hello. Oh. Oh. I'm going 
to get something for my husband. Mm -hmm. uh, let me check the shoes. Some other time. You want to search my bag? No, I'm very sorry. That I need to search your bag. Please excuse me. I think it's... Excuse me. For the sake of respect, I'm going to ask you for the last time. What do you mean? What do you mean? What? I need to search Please your bag. Please excuse me. Let me... Bring, this, bring this bag, Joe. Dominic, what is wrong with you? Do you have to embarrass our customers? Come on, shut up. Don't care. Don't you know she's a thief? You know what she has just done? Eh? Now, let's see what it is. Okay, go ahead. She has already paid for this. What is this? What is this? What is this? I told you this woman she's a materialistic demon. For God's sake, I didn't know. You were there with me. Did, did you see me carry any wristwatch? I don't know, madam. I don't know. You will explain that to the police. For God's hey, sake, I don't know how this thing got into the bag now. The 
know what's going to happen. <sighs> now, you're going to be here until the manager comes. For God's sake, I did not take the wristwatch. Now, we are going she to was here with me now. <laughs> I did not take the wristwatch. Madam, nobody wants to embarrass you. <sighs> so you will sit down here until the manager comes. Then you can explain yourself. And that's all about it. I do not take the risk. Which I don't know how that thing went. You see, you girls are very stupid. You are too, you, you are very dull. If, oh, if you are the only person here, you will have gone. That's all. Oh God. And the woman responsible. Get down. I didn't do it as well. I swear you. You, you didn't do what? You didn't do what? I saw the police report and it states that you took the wristwatch. Look, I know what it took me to bail you. So why don't you have the conscience to tell me what happened? But somebody's trying to set me up. How can you believe such a thing? Oh, okay. They're trying to set you up. They say, you know what you need? You need a good psychologist. Why are you talking like this? Why are you talking like this? Why would I talk like this? Look, the problem is that most kleptomaniacs don't even know they're one. Are you calling me a kleptomaniac now? What else do you want me to call you but a klepto? You walk into a shop with, with, with a, a handbag filled with money, yet you steal a wristwatch. Now, how do I know that this is not just a rising trend? And the, the, the same thing did not happen to the car I gave to you, which you claimed was stolen by robbers. How do I not know that you didn't sell it? Abel, please, I'm innocent, Abel, you, You're please. innocent. Yeah, oh yeah. You're innocent. But just, just, just keep away from me. Abel, just keep away. Abel, please, Abel, please. Abel, please, I didn't do it. Oh, just keep away.
head about what happened. And naturally, you being somebody that I hold very dear to my heart, I decided to come and see you. That was very bad of Lisa. Ah. Yeah, that's my portion. I always get humiliated by the women I fall in love with. Lisa is somebody I've known well in school. She has always been a thief and a kleptomaniac. Wait a minute. You mean she was like this even when she was in school? She was caught twice and disgraced publicly in school. Hm. They almost expelled her, just that we had to beg, we even got a pastor. I thought she had changed. Why didn't anyone tell me? Why didn't anybody tell me? Honey, I thought you wouldn't believe me, so I decided to let you find out on your own. Why would Lisa do this to me? Why? Why? Hey, Belle. What happened between both of us? I mean, what I did to you while I was in school. It was all part of school life. I'm not a changed person. Honestly, it's hard to see a girl or a guy that was in school then that wasn't like that. The most important thing is when one leaves school, the whole thing becomes past tense. I don't know what to believe anymore. I just, I just don't. I'm telling you, I just. I know I hurt you so much, but one thing I wouldn't do is to disgrace you publicly. I wouldn't do that. Hmm? We belong to each other. Well, give me just one more chance and I'll make it up to you. See, uh, I... I'm not ready to jump into another relationship as it is. I just, I, I can't handle it. Honey, honey, I'm not another relationship. I'm an old flame that has refused to burn out. Honey, honey, I miss you so much. I don't think I... I want you back in my Office. Your receptionist told me you've not had lunch today. Mm -hmm. Well, my workload is killing. I just have to sort too many things out um, before tomorrow morning. That's as if you don't starve to death by tomorrow morning. Look at you. You look so lean. That's the same shirt you wore two days ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're right. Uh, I've been so busy that I've not had time for myself. I shouldn't have let you fall into the hands of those scheming girls. Oh. <clears throat> Guess what? What? Ta -da! What's this? Remember how you used to buy me things in the past? Yeah, I remember. Well, see, then I used to buy those things, not because I had so much money, but because I was in love with you and I wanted you to be happy. I feel the same way now. I feel the same way. It's so strong. Can I have the key to your phone's door? <laughs> the, the keys to my phone door? Mm -hmm. Why? I want to prepare your favorite meal for dinner tonight. I want it to be ready before you get home. Alright. 
these are the keys to all the doors in the house. What's going to stand up and give me a hug? rush to see him and then come and see you. The news is everywhere. It's all over. How for goodness sake. I didn't do it, Lara. I know. Yeah. Eh? Why would I do such a thing? I've known you for long now. Eh? When I heard it, I had to rush to Abel. Then I said, let me come and see you too. Eh? How can you believe such nonsense? Such rubbish. A friend of mine that she'll be coming to see you this evening. See me for what? She said you promised her marriage and that you must marry her or else hmm, your life will be so miserable. Lisa said that. Of course. Lisa said that. <clears throat> I know what to do. I'm gonna go straight to her place and sort these things out. It, what else does she want from me? What? I need to just go 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 out there and, and, and settle this once and for all. That that's no, what no, I'm no, 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 no. Let her play her game first. You don't blow the gun. She's going to come over. She will definitely come. If she's the one that says she will come, allow her come first. Okay? Sure? Of course. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'll do that. I'll do that. Who's that? Who's at the door? Maybe it's her. Mm -hmm. Let me handle this. What she wants? Have you been to the police station like you asked? For what? 
Have you come to ask me or to force me to, to marry you? But what else you want from me? Hey, but please, for crying out loud. What are you talking about? All I'm saying is... I'm saying what are you trying to say? What? Listen, listen. I, I just got back from work and I, I am really tired. Sincerely, I am. I need you to rest, okay? If you don't mind. Hey, Hello, please. Hello, please. I have not been able to eat, sleep, or think properly ever since this embarrassing incident. Hello, please. It's terrible. I really need you now, please. Listen, listen, listen. You don't need me. The only person you need right now is a psychiatrist, not me. That's the only person you need. the problem with you men? You get carried away with these so-called innocent looking girls. Mm. Just be careful. She might poison you one of those days. She, she wouldn't dare. <laughs> Is it not the Lisa I know? The Lisa I knew. Please, let you say so. What have I gotten myself into? What is going on? Thank God you're here. I really need someone to talk to. Is it about the police concerning the theft accusation? No, it's Ava. It's Ava. He doesn't even want to talk to me. This whole thing is tearing me apart. What is it again? <laughs> Yesterday, Laura said Abel asked her to cook for him. And Wait Lara... a minute. Abel asked Lara to cook for him? What for? She, she came here, she said, she told me she didn't want to do it, but she had to because that's the only channel to bring both of us together. Uh -huh. And what happened? So I went there as planned. Everyone wanted to see me. He just slammed the door and let me outside. Ah, okay. Have you seen? Have you seen Lara since then? No, so I thought I should call you. Perhaps you can help me, please. I don't. I don't know what is going on, especially with these new developments. But just, just give me time, okay? Give me time. Huh? I'll go and see Abel. Talk to him. Then Lara. Then finally I'll get back to you. No, please, please, this whole thing is killing me, please. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, okay. don't worry. I'm, I'm sorry down. for keeping you waiting. Oh, there's no problem, you sent for me. Actually, um, Lara, there's something we need to discuss. Mm. Um, you see, between you and I, mm, I know you're seeing Abel again. There's nothing between Abel and I. Abel is just an old friend that wants to get married to my friend. And you think by going over to his house and cooking for him, you'll make the marriage work? Oof. Gina, I didn't invite myself to Abel's house to cook for him. 
Abel invited me over to his place. And I told um, Lisa before going, Lara, did you spend the night there? What kind of question is that? No, 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 what kind of question is that? Ha! Am I a kid or something? Why are you questioning me? Lara, one of your friends is having a problem. This is not the right time for you to try to get back into Abel's life. Mm -hmm. Ah! Call me here to insult me. To ask me all this. I do not keep friendship with a thief. Lisa is not a thief. Her so called fiance thinks so. Gina, why don't you let the man decide who he wants? Oh my god. Good morning, Mr. Ebe. Oh! Hello. Uh, you must be the um, officer in charge of uh, Lisa's case, right? Yes. Please sit down. She's actually supposed to report to the office today, but she didn't. She didn't. Have you had her arrested? We won't go to that extreme yet. And since you're her husband, you have to give us the authority to do that. A uh, point of correction, um, officer. I am not her husband, neither am I her fiancé. But that wasn't what you said when you came on her bill. Yes, I know that was not what I said, but um, things have taken a new turn. I mean, things have changed, taken a new dimension since then. Okay, I just don't want to be bothered or disturbed on, on, on this issue. Okay? Mr. Abel? We will still hold you responsible until you bring her to the station yourself and officially apply for your withdrawal on her bill. Alright. I'll do that. I'll do just that. but I'm not angry anymore. <laughs> you see, he's lying. <laughs> Let's kill him as plan and get on with other jobs. Yes. No. Sir. Shut up! No, sir. Sir? 
<laughs> I'm not so he wants to leave this place. I'll go straight to us. If I leave this place, I'm going to leave this place. I'll go marry her, please. <laughs> now you're crying. You don't want to die. No, sir. But you turned your back on her. I'm sorry, sir. Close your eyes. It's a... I said, close your eyes. Please, I'll marry her. I'll leave this place, I swear. Close your eyes! Please, sir. Please. 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 I'll give you a second chance. Thank you, sir. God bless yes. you. Sir. Shut up! Shut up! I'll give you a second chance. Okay, sir. If you like, when once you leave here, go out there and do whatever you feel like. No. Mm -hmm. oh, this man is this strong. I know, I'm, I'm not strong. I'm not, no, I'm not uncle, I'm not uncle, no, uncle, 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 uncle. Hey! 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 Uncle, uncle, please, uncle, uncle, from the Air Command. You are under arrest. What for? The kidnapping and attempted murder. My God. I, I don't know what you're talking about. You heard me right. Sergeant, so arrest her. Okay, let me call my boss. Let me call. No, no, please. Please call the boss. I will do that. It's okay. I'm all right. It's all right. Oh, what would I have done? If those criminals, if they had killed you, what would I have done? How would I have explained it? It's all right. Thank God they didn't. Okay? Do you know, I almost stopped you from going out yesterday morning. I felt it. I was so strong, I felt it that something was going to happen. If only I stopped you! Oh, it's all right. Lara, why, why would Lara do this to me? Mm. The officers are not in charge. She's not in their custody. She's in their custody now. Uh, has she been arrested? They've arrested her. They're in charge now. Mm. 
Girl Lee. Hi. Girl that was Lee. a very good oh. job. Anyway, I'm glad I was still impressed just like school days. Mm, just like the old school days. So have fun now. What's up? I'll be leaving for Abuja tonight, sir. Mm, Abuja, what's in the oven there, sir? Nothing serious, sir. You got the money. <laughs> oh, you want money, money, money. Of yeah, course. I, mm, I beg you, take. Mm? Sweet tea. You kept your word. Mm-hmm. What's your thing, sir? It's so deadly. Take a music now, relax. This is not tea. I can't wait to see you. Sarah, let's see you. Here we go. Keep it. Okay. What is that mean? That's a good friend of mine. Why? Asking me why, Lara? You are asking me why when I warned you that no man must be allowed into this house. Hey, Edward, save your breath. This is going to be the last time we're going to see each other. We are now history. What are you talking about? I am getting married, so it is over. Read my lips. It is over. I mean, we are now history. Huh? Excuse me, please. <clears throat> um, please remember to shut the door for me, okay? This is about the most stupid thing I've ever heard. Look at me, Jim. Do I look like someone who would want to kill a man because I want him to marry me? So have you seen Abel or spoken to him since then? No. They wouldn't let me see him. After all, he's a complainant. Don't worry, I'll contract a lawyer. Hmm? He'll be here in the morning. Have you made a statement? Said till tomorrow morning. Well, I'll see April. Okay. And I'll be here in the morning. Come on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Your time is up, I bet. Waka. Waka, waka, waka. I bet. Go. I guess you heard uh, how your so-called friend dealt with me. I, I heard the story. It's so shocking. So strange. Shocking? Yeah. <laughs> I had a gun pointed to my head. I was beaten up like, like, like a little child. I was treated like a common criminal. And, and you, you say it's shocking? <laughs> Because when I heard Lisa could be involved, I, I had to hear the story from your own point of view. Well, I, 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 I don't know what else to say. I was shocked myself. Sarah, what are you doing here? Mm -hmm. I do not owe you an explanation. How sure you do? The other time you came here to do some cooking and now you're here dressed like this. I didn't know I had to seek your consent before visiting people. People? Ah. You call your friend's fiancé people? I do not hold friendship with a thief and a murderer. Not when my fiancé is involved. Um, um, fiancé? Mm -hmm. What are you talking about? Um, Gina, actually, um, Laura and I are back together. We plan to get married very soon. Gina, 
You are happily married. You had better remain our family friend by allowing my own happiness or be a stranger by staying away and minding your own business. Abel, I'm so disappointed in you. Very disappointed in you. Nosy Parker. I'm sorry about this. It's okay. Let's go to bed. I just received and confirmed a court order for the release on bail of the suspect we brought in a week ago, Miss Lisa Okeke. The same woman that hired some assassins to torture Mr. Bell? Yes, sir. Can I just brought in now with a qualified short team? But on what ground is the court granting her bail? Uh, same old story. No witness or connection of the suspect to the incident. Let me know. Okay. You can go ahead and release our head. Yes. I think somebody's after me, and I'm going to find out. You think so? It was before it was the shoplifting stuff, and now this. Lisa, I'm not really sure, but I think Lara is behind all, all of it. <laughs> Lara, no, no. Gina, Lara has been very supportive. She has. But Abel and Lara are back together again. What? Yes. When I went over to Abel's house, Lara was there. Doing what? originally belongs to me at my own expense Lara. Oh. at my own expense eh? go home little girl you don't come around here trying to play the games man for big girls you Lara, you will not get away with this make no mistake about this make no mistake about this did you hear me you have nothing on me you have nothing on me you okay. get me you ought to be ashamed of yourself Lara. if you think you're going to get to you better start thinking again start thinking again it is over lisa it is over get your hands off my car it is over for you and it's a brand new beginning for me. Get this junk out of here. It is over. Oh. Oh. Look at you. Ah. What rubbish. How are you? Nice to see you again. I really came to say thank you for bailing me out the other day. I'm glad you appreciate. But I'll be happy if you extend the appreciation by telling me the truth. 
Do you have to go that far over a man? Honestly, sir, I did not send anyone to attack him. I did not. You don't have to tell me lies, Lisa. Remember, I, Chief Williams, staked my reputation to bail you. I swear, sir, I did not. I mean, why would I want to do such a thing? Am I that desperate? But there is an evidence. Abel said that the attacker said that... the attackers did what they were asked to do. I'm sure somebody's trying to set me up. Who could that be and why? So, there's another lady. Yes. Abel's former girlfriend. I think she's the one behind all this. Is this another all women affairs? Do you have any proof? To support this? No, sir, I don't. But I know God will see me through. I want this to be cleaned up. Twice the police came to arrest you and detain you in the office. You have to clear this mess. Otherwise, I'll be forced to fire you. Is that okay? I'm sorry, sir. I'm very sorry. It's alright. Did you come in a car? Yes, sir. My car is out. This key, just like old time. <laughs> Relax now. Honey. Honey, what's keeping you? I'm waiting. Honey, what's so going on? Are we not going anymore? Huh? Honey, what's going on? I, I, I've been waiting for you. I've been waiting. We can go now. I, I thought I heard voices. Who are you talking with? Voices. Voices? No, I was just singing. Singing? Yes. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. See, I'm, I'm extremely thirsty. Let me get one up in the kitchen. Mm. What? Um, the fridge, I mean, there's a kitchen. Yeah. The fridge in the kitchen is bad. Oh. Ah, honey, I'm so pressed. Could you just go upstairs to my room and get the water from my fridge? Okay, okay. Are you sure A statement from the suspect, Miss Lisa, that Miss Lara has an idea as to who may be responsible for your attack. What sort of rubbish is that? You see, it's not possible that my uh, fiancé here has a hand in this. It's just not possible. That thief is only going to send you on a wild good chase. Ha! Um, detective, you see, um, when I had this problem, my fiancé took me to the hospital. And from the hospital, she brought me down to the police station. So how is it possible that she was behind all these? It's obvious that Lisa is trying to uh, confuse you, mislead you. Anyway, I thought I should come around and check out information myself. Mr. Abel, 
I also learned that uh, Lisa has a case of shoplifting, of which you took her on bail. Yeah. Unfortunately, yes. I did. The case has just been transferred to us. You have to come to the station with her tomorrow. I'll see what I can do. It's okay. I'll see you tomorrow, Mr. Heber. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going, go. Hey. I thought you said you were coming at the weekend. Uh, yeah, I decided to come watch you earlier because of the emergency that I have to discuss with you. Mm. Yeah. Okay, no problem. Come right in. Huh? Yeah. So, how's everything? No problem. How's the uh, equal equipment? No problem. Okay. <laughs> yeah, please. Let's sit over yeah. there. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, hey, buddy. Big man, the girl. So, um, oh, what do I offer you? I've got cognac, I've got uh, wine. I am alright. Are you sure? I'm alright. Yeah. Okay. So, what is this um, very urgent thing you wanted to discuss with me? It's about Lisa. The girl you said you want to marry. Yeah. Well, um, the wedding is off. I changed my mind. Hey, well. I'm sorry, I can't let you do that. Please. <laughs> Why? Edward. Why are you so bothered about this? Remember, Lisa is a girl you love so much. Yeah. But you plan to marry her in the next one month. Yeah, I know. I know, but the wedding is off. Hey, girl. When we met at any you we were a friend. A very good friend. And I'm very grateful for all the help you rendered to me. But now, I don't know wish to betray that kindness. Now you're getting me confused. What are you talking about? What's the connection between what happened between you and I, Enugu and Lisa, and whether I marry her or I don't marry her? What's going on? Maybe. Did you or Lisa know a young lady named Lara? Yeah, we, we, we know her. Why? You see, all you've been through this past weeks. Lisa is not responsible. Man, man, get serious. She's innocent. How, how can you say she's innocent? Man, look at my hand. Yeah, well, she's innocent. It was a setup. Oh, come on. Edward, look, you're my friend. I, I, I don't want to get angry with you, okay? How can you be talking about setup? Setup by who? Lara set her Look, all the evidences point to her. Even the men who kidnapped me claim that she sent them to do this to me. Now you're saying Lara did. It's not possible. Okay, okay. Let's assume it's true. How, how come you know all this? Huh? How come? It was done through me. I'm sorry. What did she say? I said it was done for me. Yes. I 
sir, this is Mr. Abel. Yes, sir, I, I, I saw the suspect that uh, kidnapped me and broke my hand. Yes, um, I'm right now in front of the uh, Ultimate Plaza. Yes, he went in there. Yes. Thank you, thank you. We'll be waiting for you at the junction. Thank you very much. Bye, bye, sir. Thank you. They're yeah, coming. Collins have just confessed. Yeah, excuse me, man. Sit down. You know who I am. I want to know Sorry. who you are or what you are. Sit down. No, this is Nigeria. I don't have the drive. Sit. Excuse me, I'm not sitting down. I don't want to know who you are. Who are you? I said, sit, sit, sit down. down. This is my woman. Sit, sit down. I'm not sitting down. Sit you. I don't shut up. Sit down. Thank <laughs> you. 
come out to tell the truth, would you have ever believed me? Would you? Listen. Listen, listen. If... It wasn't my fault. If you were in my shoes, you, you, you probably have done the same thing. I was deceived. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. Let, let's put all this behind us. I so want to put all this behind me. And the only way to do that is for you to stay with me. I can come back to you. I'm sorry. No, no, Lisa, don't say that. Please. I, I need you. How can you how can you possibly need a woman you don't have faith or trust in? Lisa, I'm, I'm sorry. Please don't do this to me, please. If it's the will of God for us to be together again, I'm sure he'll make a way. But right now, 